you know, there are so many adages we can say revenge is best served cold let go let God live and let die forgive and forget etc 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 sometimes you just got to let it be what it's going to be. Most oftentimes, the best thing you can do for yourself and the worst thing you can do for someone else is to let them be. and let them have to deal with themselves. If you're good, if you've done what you could, should, would, need to do, or beyond that, or if you just made the decision to cut and run, and you know where you stand or where you stood, you're good. But if you're the person that is on the dumbassedness side of the equation, that's coin. That's the term I coined, dumbassedness. If you're on that side of the equation, whew, buckle up. Because at some point, you're going to walk past the mirror and you're going to have to deal with you. Nobody can claim perfection. And if you do, yeah, I'm going to leave that one alone. But we all have had our whatever's some point or another and I know I've been the one <clears throat> that has been on the dumbassedness side of the scale at one point or another in my life I'm glad I don't sit there now I've had to deal with myself. So I know what it's like. And that's why I say, the best and the worst thing you can do is to let whoever, whatever, deal with themselves. Now, with that I say, be all that you are supposed to be constantly, consistently, perpetually, in spite of, and do it effortlessly. We don't give to get, we shouldn't. And we don't get to give. You shouldn't have to. It should all be symbiotic. But it should just be naturally. Love yourself, love others. Love the universe. Accept the universe as love. And keep it flowing. That is the most efficient and effective recycling one could ever do. 
Recycle the love, y'all. Doesn't matter what can you put it in. Just recycle it. I'm out. Thoughts from the basement.